Olympic officials have come in for questions as first one, and then two, of the pools in Rio changed from a crystal clear blue to a deep and murky green. Some athletes complained of stinging eyes and that they couldn't see properly, as chlorine levels were blamed for the shade change. It's very difficult to play in this water because the chlorine is really, really strong for the eyes, said Mladen Janovic, a water polo player from Montenegro. You cannot even see. When they finished their matches, I saw Hungarians, Australians and also Greek players, it was like everybody was crying. On Wednesday, Ryan Locke made his way onto the podium to celebrate the USA's win in the men's 4x200m freestyle relay. To celebrate, he yesterday posted an image of he and his teammates, including Michael Phelps, clutching their gold medals aloft. But there seemed to be something very wrong with Locke's hair, it too had turned green. The Olympian had already turned heads when, at the Rio opening ceremony, he revealed he had dyed his normally brown hair a shimmering silvery grey with a touch of blue. But the blue seems to have gone, replaced by a color to match the Olympic pools. People commenting on his Instagram account hailed Locked as a new merman and speculated if he had dyed his hair as an early homage to St. Patrick's Day. However, others had a more convincing theory, suggesting the Olympic pools had been a hair dye disaster for Locked. He, along with every other swimmer, probably knows that chlorine turns hair green, said one with the general consensus being pool chemicals and hair dye just don't mix. But, it appears, Locked was messing with his social media followers after all, deliberately doctoring the photos to ensure his hair color matched the hue of Rio's worrying pools. And besides, the pools that went green were the water polo and diving pools. While Locked's victory was at the indoor, and still very blue, swimming pool.